super excited and wow, just looking at all these bikes, I'm like, wow, should I upgrade to a bigger bike because they look so cool. My body, Harry. What's up? Oh, what's up, guys? <laughs> and we are here today with DNC, which is one of the most exclusive motorcycle clubs here in Indonesia. DNC, uh, a new, a new community uh -huh. has already like 100 members. Start with DNC Car Club, and uh -huh. then they make DNC Big Bike. Okay. So yeah, I'm honored to be here because I think it's a plus 500 cc yeah. club, right? Yeah. But I can still join today, even though my bike is only 250 cc. No so matter. thank you so much for inviting me. Thank you. Thank you. You know, today I'm just here to connect, meet a lot of new people and uh, hopefully we will have an amazing day. So uh, yeah, I think we're ready, Junior. Yeah? Awesome, let's do it. Wow, guys, this is crazy. There are so many riders here today. I can't even. There's gotta be at least at least 200 people. Just have to leave now in a hurry because the police were coming and apparently at the moment you're only allowed to be like 50 people at the um, at this meeting place at Sanang City so they, the police came to try and break up the group and apparently they do this a lot oh it's kind of uh, chaotic when you don't have so I don't have the intercom most of the other guys they have an intercom I'm just trying to follow along. Honestly, I'm so confused. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. Uh, and I think I lost June. This is the group, yeah? Okay, okay. Nice. Let's see if we can find Harry, yeah? my bike was exploding but it was the bike in front of me making so much noise I 
split the group, but I think the group has split up. Wait, you're not sure where to go? So right now I'm just following the group, hoping that we're gonna stop somewhere soon for something to eat or something to drink because right now it's just like driving around crazy fast. Alright, thank god we're stopping. Alright guys, so we are here with the big motorcycle group. Now we made our first stop and there's gotta be at least 50 big bikes here and I'm the only one driving here 2cc so I'm so grateful for being here thank you so much to uh, Harry Afandi for inviting me to this event I'm meeting so many nice new people and it's such a new experience for me because we're driving in this massive group and they are driving so fast and I'm just trying to be careful and not to drive into anyone it's a fun experience and I'm meeting so many nice people but I'm interested to know like why is it so popular to ride in these groups? So let's just quickly ask some of the guys here what they think is the best thing about being a part of a group like this and riding together. So let's go ask them. Of course, to meet new friends, explore new places, and of course, to warm up your bike. Okay, hello guys. Jadi, menurut gua hal terbaik dari punya hobi motor adalah bisa merasakan adrenalin yang luar biasa ya. Jadi kalau moge kan tenaganya gede. Jadi saat kita buka gas tuh, uh, traction-nya, power-nya, willy-willy-nya itu bikin kangen itu adrenalin yang bikin kita kangen setiap minggu gitu jadi gua rasa yang terbaik dari hobi naik motor adalah itu keep safety ya halo bro, gua Blo Rizky kembali lagi di youtuber tidak terkenal dan famous youtuber in Indonesia in Indonesia is doesn't know about Blo Rizky even I have a 70 or 7500 sus... 70... oi! 7500! 75! Hundred, what got him there? I still learning, my brain is burn now. <laughs> okay, jadi kali ini kita lagi riding semuanya kawan-kawan. Nah, di konten kali ini si Mas Chris bertanya tentang opini pribadi mengenai ya riding untuk ala-ala biker di Indonesia. Jadi sesuatu hal yang paling enak tuh di kendaraan adalah pertama ketika kita berkendara ya adalah sensasinya yang kita cari. Look, oh, gila moge, oh. Nah itu adalah sensasi berkendara yang kita cari-cari selama di jalanan kawan-kawan Tapi ingat, be careful bro Because speed can kill you What's up guys? It's Aaron MV Yeah, I want to talk to you guys about being the only one of the only white guys Not only white guy now I mean it's fantastic It's great for making friends Great for making new opportunities, meeting new people Overall, it's like a big family it's Like It's like a new family uh, Bikers are not just friends, they are family Happy Sunday guys <laughs> the is so All right, guys, it's time for us to get back on the road. We just had a, some iced tea here, had a chat at Papa Jack's. This is a typical meeting place here in Jakarta for motorcycle clubs. We are going now to Double E Garage to test drive the KTM 390. So we're gonna go now. And uh, yeah, just got the signal that it's time to leave. So let's go. I'm so happy that I've started to, to meet up with these these guys because make so many new friends here and they're all just so nice and so welcoming. Guys, we have arrived here at Ecclesia Auto Garage. Whoa, there's a lot of bikes here. Interesting. And today we're gonna be test driving the. Hey guys, how are you? Yeah. Hello, hello. Say Chris. Today we're gonna be test riding the KTM 390. Hey, nice to meet you, I'm Chris. Nice, Makana and everything. So uh, let's do it. All right, guys. So it is time to test ride the KTM 390. So this is an adventure touring bike, and I've been 
I've been looking to try something like this for a while. So this is quite higher riding position than my MT. You can see I can just stand here with my toes. I'm sitting much more upright on this bike. Um, which is gonna make it much more comfortable when I go on a big trip. So I'm actually considering if I should buy this bike because it has more CCs. It's a faster, bigger engine and it has a better suspension. It's a higher riding position, more comfortable riding position. And this is basically a bike that's made for trips like the ones I'm going on, right? And this is also what I think is kind of cool. So you have like this electric screen that you can connect with your phone. So you can put on like the music, you can check the calls and uh, charge my phone. I can even change it to like on-road, off-road, take off the, uh, the ABS brakes. I can take off traction control. So it's a very intelligent bike, I would say. And to be honest, I think it looks hell cool. Okay, first corner. Wow. So much more comfortable than the MT. Okay, let's test the speed, yeah. Even though it's an adventure bike, it's fast. <laughs> and it's so good in the turns, it's so comfortable. I wish we had some dirt roads or something like that that we could test that out on as well. I wanna go in there. So, I asked for off-road, and now we're gonna get it. Let's hope I don't break the bike. Okay, so this is, as you can see, some of the terrain that I would normally be riding on on my trips the suspension is uh, okay i would say there we go change it to off-road so i'm guessing that this is going to change the suspension uh oh it felt like it just fell down a little bit okay let's try that out okay let's just try and drive over some bumps and see if that changed anything okay no joke the suspension is way better now so i want to say the major difference between the m225 and this one is simply the steering it's so easy for me to do these turns sitting much more upright on this bike the seating is more comfortable and also really nice is that i'm sitting higher up than i do on the yamaha mt25 oh yeah good day mate nice bike wow i've seen people do this in videos like standing up on their bikes it's hard for the legs though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Very hard for the legs. But then you don't get those like don't, don't, don't. Nice, proper bike. Proper adventure, eh, mate? Whoa. This is a nice bike. When I first saw it, I thought, okay, this is kind of a, you know, a good looking bike, but not that good you know because the price is not so high but i actually feel like this is a very nice bike so i'm interested to hear guys let me know in the comments down below do you think i should buy this bike or should i not what do you say all right guys and that concludes their review so question would i buy this bike honestly yes why because of it's fast the handling is so good um, and the, the riding position. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching today. We've had such a good day riding with the motorcycle group and now here at Ecclesia Auto Garage here with Edward. Thank you so much for letting me try some of the motorcycles. You will definitely be back. Hey, thank you, man. My pleasure. So, guys, that's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and until next time.